Welcome to Newsline. A visit to Serbia by Russian Foreign Minister Sergei Lavrov has been cancelled because three of Serbia's neighbors have refused to let his plane use their airspace. EU member Bulgaria imposed the flight ban, along with North Macedonia and Montenegro. Countries hoping, like Serbia, to join the EU. Russia's invasion of Ukraine triggered an EU airspace ban in February. Mr. Lavrov has blamed the Brussels puppeteers for the latest move. Serbia has not joined the EU's wide-ranging sanctions against Russia and remains friendly with the nation. The EU and UK imposed a blanket flight ban on Russian planes, including the private jets of oligarchs, days after the February 24 invasion. Like many other European countries, Serbia relies heavily on Russian gas. Mr. Lavrov was to have had talks in Belgrade with President Aleksandr Vucic on 6 to 7 June. In a statement broadcast on Russian state news channel Rossiya 24, he described the decision as unprecedented and said that no one will be able to destroy our relations with Serbia. He also said, it seems that the Brussels puppeteers very much did not want to again give us a platform so that in the capital of Serbia we could confirm Russia's position on the problem of Kosovo and the problem of Bosnia-Herzegovina. They probably did not want us to express support for Belgrade's initiative to realize the Open Balkans project in the interests of making healthier, stronger relations between all the countries of the region. The Kremlin strongly backs Serbia's refusal to recognize Kosovo's independence. Russia was angered by the NATO bombing campaign against Serbia in 1999 during the Kosovo War. In his statement on Monday, Mr. Lavrov accused NATO and the EU of wanting to turn the Balkans into their own project called Closed Balkans. Commenting on the move to bar Mr. Lavrov's flight, a Russian foreign ministry source said our diplomacy has yet to master teleportation. Serbia's interior minister, Aleksandr Vulin, said he deeply regretted the obstruction of Lavrov's visit, adding Serbia is proud that it is not part of the anti-Russian hysteria. In early March, thousands of pro-Russian Serbs marched through Belgrade, reflecting the country's traditionally close ties. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and like the video for more breaking news.